The cars are streaming into this Magna neighborhood to see this annual Christmas light spectacle. This began about two decades ago, and it started thanks to one small display. It's just family, this whole street. Bob Lemon is one of the founding residents of this little Magna subdivision. Well, we were all sitting around one day. The county wanted a name for the street, and we kept looking in the phone book. Everything was taken, and one of the ladies says, it'd be a miracle if we ever get this done. That's the name. <laughs> the name Miracle Cove stuck. Well, it kind of gradually started a little bit at a time. And as this neighborhood was born in the late 90s. That nativity over there was my original. So was a holiday light display. I've had that for about 25 years. A bright scene. Every year somebody, you know, you just add something else and it just caught on with the whole street. When the Grinchiest of Grinches couldn't help but love. It's never been a formal competition, but I think deep down it's, what am I going to do to beat so-and-so this year? <laughs> The neighbors here don't do this for fame or fortune. Did you hear that? That's why. That's why. It brings much joy. It brings joy to the kids. Their efforts are paid back with smiles. In my heart, that's why I, I do this. Because of the thanks that people give us. And in a year like the one we've all endured. We definitely need the joy. It, this year has been something else. Those smiles. It brings a lot of joy to people. Are worth even more this holiday season. With all the junk that's happened this year, 2020, we need a little love at the end here to close out the year. This street gets even more special on Christmas Eve. The residents line both sides of the sidewalk with luminarias. We'll post the exact coordinates of this neighborhood on our website at fox13now.com. In Magna, John Franke, Fox 13 News, Utah.